Hey guys, welcome back to Vlogmas Day 11. Um, today's video is going to be a little bit different than most of my Vlogmas videos that I've been doing. Um, the boys and I did not work on our advent calendar or our activity today. I had um, a lot of stuff that I needed to finish up for work for this week. Um, and I still didn't finish it, but I'll tell you about that in just a second. Um, and so, and I feel like we've been doing it every single day this week, our Christmas study, and the boys just kind of wanted a day where they could just like veg out and watch TV and go outside and play. And they um, have bought some Nerf guns and they want to have Nerf gun battles and just things like that. So I thought, you know, I've got to get work done. They want a break, so we'll just not do an activity today. I think our activity for today was to make Christmas cards, and they've already made some Christmas cards. Um, and we can always tack that on to another day. Anyway, I'm trying to make sure I don't pull out in front of any cars. Um, anyway, so with that said, I, let me put this down so the sun is not in my face. Um, so with that said, I'm sitting in my bedroom at my window seat, which is typically where I work because I have a good view of outside and it looks really nice out there. Um, and it's just a nice place to work. And I am thinking all of a sudden, it's like it hits me and I'm just like, you know what? I think I'm going to go out tonight. I'm just going to go by myself. I'm going to go shopping. I'm going to go get my hair cut. I'm just going to go and have a night just for me, <laughs> like a self care night. Um, Sometimes I get in those little moods where I just feel like I'm ready for a change and I have been feeling that way lately. Um, it has been a long time, it feels like, since I've done this sort of thing. I mean, probably since the beginning of the year. And I, I don't actually even remember the last time. Um, sorry, my camera's bouncing because I'm driving and the road's bumpy. Um, anyway, yeah, since before all of this COVID stuff, um, that is the last time that I've gone somewhere to have my hair cut. I have been cutting my hair at home. Um, I've watched some YouTube videos on how to cut your own hair, and I've tried two different ways of cutting my hair. Um, the first one didn't work as well. I cut out like a big chunk of it. You can see that there's a lot of short pieces right here, and I cut a little too like harsh on that, like a too harsh of an angle right there. The second one was like the ponytail method where you put your ponytail right here in your forehead and then you cut your hair at an angle to give yourself a lot of um, layers and that worked well. Um, I did have to have my sister-in-law kind of like fix things a little bit because she usually like cuts our hair if we ask her to or whatever. Um, but anyway, it's been forever since I've actually gone to the salon and had my hair cut. You know, everything was shut down and then things opened up and then I was on this like, I'm gonna save money and budget kind of kick for a while this summer, which is good and I'm still like committed to not wasting money. Um, so I was cutting my own hair. Um, but my hair, I the last time, I think the last time that I went to the salon, I accidentally had them cut my hair too short. I wanted it um, closer to my shoulders, kind of like a medium length, and it was really long. And I had her, I had her keep like taking off like a quarter of an inch until it got to the length I wanted. And I wasn't thinking that my hair was gonna dry and shorten. So my hair ended up being like at my shoulders, if not above my shoulders. I couldn't even get in a ponytail. And I mean, it was fine. Like the style that she cut into my hair looked good. It was just way shorter than I wanted. I don't really care for my hair being that short. Um, there are definitely some really short haircuts that look good on some people. I don't think they look good on me. I am more of a long hair, medium to long hair length person. Anyway, I've let my hair grow out since then all year long and it's kind of to the point where I, I keep a lot of layers in it because my hair is very thick but it's fine and it won't hold curl or style very well unless I have layers in to give it more body um, and it's kind of just in that mode where it's just flat right now and I have to do a lot of work to it to get it to hold curl or whatever so it's like I don't want to spend a ton of time getting ready in the mornings um, Sometimes I like spending more time getting ready. It depends on like if I'm going out or, you know, I don't know, going on a date, just whatever kind of special occasion. But on the regular, like daily getting ready, I mean, normally like I throw my hair up and like I twist it up and pull it up and that's how I wear it. But 
Um, if I'm just doing like a daily, weekly kind of thing, I don't want my hair to take forever to get, you know, fixed and ready. And so it takes a lot of shampoo and conditioner to wash it. It takes a long time to blow dry it. It takes a long time to curl it or style it in any way, just because it's long and I have a lot of hair. Um, so I just decided I'm gonna go and get my hair cut back to a medium length, which is where I had it cut probably two or three years ago. I had, I wore my hair long for years and years and years. It's always been really long. Um, and I had it cut to about a medium length like I said, three or four years ago, I loved it. And then it was like, it must have just been the stylist because every other time I've gone to get that same style of cut in my hair, it didn't look as good. So I finally just let it kind of grow back out. Um, then I tried again for that short one and got it way too short. And then I'm now it's all grown back out. Um, and now I'm gonna go again and I'm gonna get it cut medium length, but I'm kind of doing a different style this time. Anyway, I have a photo on my phone and I'll show the stylist and we'll see if she can cut it into my hair. <laughs> um, either way, it'll cut out a lot of this, a lot of these layers that are around the front of my face. Some of them may be too short and it'll take some time for them to grow out, but that's okay. Um, I'm just kind of ready to get a bunch of this length off and hopefully it'll feel nice and clean and it'll look um, just different, look better. I don't know. Sometimes I just get in the mood where I want things to be Quite different than they are like I get bored of things um, I am that kind of person that I don't think I could ever go with something super permanent on myself because I am NOT committed to things very I don't commit to things very well I don't think like long term I like to change things too much I guess I don't really know if that's the right word for it so it's like I thought I like piercings that I had when I was younger I don't even wear them anymore like I don't wear my cartilage ring and I don't have I have my belly band pierced I don't wear that anymore like just things like that I have my ears pierced twice I don't even wear two earrings in my ears I only wear one um, and then like I would love to get some tattoos I thought about that before but I'm too like I just non committed it's like I'll hate it in two years and then I don't want this permanent thing on my body and two years from now I'm gonna like really regret having it but who knows? I could just be in like a mood one day and be like, you know what? I'm getting this tattoo. I'm just going to deal with it. <laughs> who knows? Anyway, I kind of like have these like spur of the spur of the moment kind of like this is what I'm doing kind of times in my life. Um, so all of that to say, I am headed out of town. I'm going to get a haircut. I'm going to go clothes shopping. Um, oh, I almost thought I forgot my mask for a second. And then I was like, oh no. Um, it's crazy. It's crazy that we have to think these things these days but anyway um there are some stores open maybe get some shoes maybe get just some clothes it's been forever since I've gone like really gone clothes shopping um and I'm just also at this point where I feel like everything in my closet I've worn a thousand times and I'm just ready for some new stuff so hopefully I can pick up some things tonight um Dean is home with the boys he's working on the fireplace putting more rock up I don't know what the boys are going to be into tonight. Probably more Nerf gun battles because that's been their thing for the past couple of days. Um, I don't know what he's going to do for dinner tonight. Um, he was cool with me leaving and I just, I had planned for me to cook something for dinner, but he's going to be working so he's not going to stop to cook any like big meal. He will probably do something fast or like grab um, food for them, which is fine. Um, that's fun for them to have those kind of nights every once in a while where I'm not making like a sit down dinner kind of meal and they just get to eat something fun not super healthy probably <laughs> anyhow um yeah so that's what I'm gonna get up to tonight I will do my best to take you guys um with me as much as possible I seriously doubt I'm gonna be able to film at all while I'm getting my hair cut who knows we'll see um hopefully it turns out okay <laughs> I have <laughs> high hopes it's gonna look good um, and if it doesn't, then I will just go back to letting it grow out, you know. Um, I usually try to get my hair cut like once every season. So about every three months I get it cut. I am not a every six weeks haircut person. I don't, I don't think about it that often. And if I were really good at cutting my own hair, then maybe I could keep up with something like that. But like I said, I've been trying to do my own haircuts this year and I don't think 
have been all that successful at them, but I have only tried it twice, so I shouldn't act like it's not that good of a fit for me because I'm sure the more that I do it, the better I would get at it. Yeah, so I'm glad the work week is over, sort of. I Since I'm not staying home working tonight, I probably will have to do some stuff tomorrow. Probably for sure. Yep, for sure. Um, but that's okay. Like, when you have your own business, then you set your own hours. And if you have to work a little bit on a weekend every once in a while, then so be it. Um, yeah, so that's what that's what I'll be doing tomorrow because I'm taking off tonight. I don't know where I'm going to go eat. I'm not even sure what kind of food I'm in the mood for. Hmm, hmm. I'll have to think about that for a bit. Anyway, I am going to get off here and I will see you guys in a little bit guys so I don't know if you guys can tell or not but I just finished getting my hair cut sorry I'm trying to back up out of this parking lot um anyway the lighting's probably really bad um I just got my hair cut and it's much shorter so about mid-length I don't know if you guys can tell um all of the hair right up here on my face is left to grow out and then she cut in a bunch of layers in the back so like short um, layers all the way down through the length of my hair and just chopped all of the stuff off on the bottom so it looks nice and thick and um, really healthy it feels really good like all of that long hair off anyway so <clears throat> haircuts done I am headed to some stores to do a little bit of shopping and I will see you guys there bye <laughs>